Now, here's your forecast first from Fox 11 Director of Meteorology, Pete Petoniak. Check out Storm Tracker. We talked about it yesterday. We would have rain after midnight, and certainly we have that rain and some heavy rain at times, too. You can see Kewanee County all the way back. Appleton, Oshkosh, Green Bay also getting the rain. Let's zoom out a bit, and you'll see that we do have a bit of a trailing edge. Yet, yeah, don't let that fool you. We're going to have periods of rain. We might have a little bit of a break here, say, oh, between 9 and noon, maybe. And then we have some more rain this afternoon, just in time for the trick-or-treaters to go out. We have a dense fog advisory in effect as well. In the gray area that you see here, visibilities are down to about a quarter mile in places like Watoma and Shono. So that on top of the rain, be careful as you're driving to work today. 57 degrees at 10 o'clock this morning, 60 at 3 o'clock, and a chance of rain at that time, and at 7 o'clock still, periods of rain and 53 degrees. With all that said, the fog, the rain, and even a thunderstorm possible this afternoon, I'm going to still keep the severe weather index at low. Nothing widespread as far as severe weather is concerned, but we do have a warm and wet Halloween. Normal high, 50 degrees. We'll be back to 50 tomorrow, but 10 degrees warmer today. So you can see the live look from our Lambo cam here. It's raining right now. There's basically one storm system pushing in right now. And then there's another one just uh, to our southwest, and that's the one that will probably bring up some more moisture this afternoon. And that's why I do have a good chance of some rain showers in the forecast between 3 and 7 o'clock today as the kids head out for trick or treat. Future track at noon. Notice, as I said, there's a possibility of a little bit of a break here, but then as we go to 3 o'clock, there's that second surge of moisture in Green Bay, Fond du Lac, and then for the rest of us, too, at 8 o'clock, still raining, and all, still a chance of rain all the way up until about midnight. Tomorrow morning at 8 o'clock, 9 o'clock, we're going to be cloudy, and then there is a chance of some more showers late in the day, probably between oh, 4 o'clock and, say, 9 or 10 o'clock at night. So there's a chance as you head out to high school football games tomorrow night, you might need your rain poncho. 2 o'clock in the afternoon Saturday, well, we'll deal with clouds, but uh, I don't anticipate any showers. 53 in Green Bay, 52 in Appleton, and 54 in Oshkosh right now. These are mild, mild temperatures for this time of the day and this time of the year. 53 degrees in Green Bay with light rain. In Oshkosh, you notice Weather Sensor Network camera really shows it is foggy in Oshkosh. 54 degrees with uh, south-southeast winds only 3 miles an hour. So look for periods of rain today, maybe even a thunderstorm, and the dense fog this morning, 60 degrees or high. 42 for the overnight low, still cloudy with showers overnight tonight. It'll be breezy tonight, too, and tomorrow scattered showers mainly in the afternoon hours, otherwise cloudy and 50 degrees. 46 degrees on Saturday, mostly cloudy. We're looking at some sunshine on Sunday, and Sunday's high will be 50 degrees. Don't forget to fall back before you head to sleep on Saturday night as we go back to standard time. And Monday, pretty good game, pretty good day for the Packers-Bears game, 53 degrees for the high.